When you hear what I gotta say, it's all gonna make sense. I'm Keith Tozer, I'm out of Mansfield. Now ladies, I gotta say, don't get too excited here when I tell you this, because I can outrun all your boyfriends, let me tell you. I am 36 years old. Can you believe that shit? 36, but I have the body of a 29 year old male stripper. Now let me tell you, that's only because I work out six days a week. And that's because I have PTSD and I need something to do. Which I'm gonna cover why Prozac and my, what triggers me here in a few. So you're gonna hold on to that. But do you know what I found out when you work out five, six days a week? Sir, do you know what I found out? That your penis does not grow. It's the only muscle on your body, your penis won't grow. No matter how many times you work it, it does not grow bigger than nine inches. You think I'm joking. It took my wife two years to get used to nine inches. I'm serious. There is such a thing as too big for some ladies. You know that, right? Yeah. It is true. And my wife did the black guys. So what's, you know that's just a myth. Holy shit, because I'm, I'm literally one third of time. Holy shit, now you know what part is the one third. Man. And you all think I'm joking. 500 bucks, I'll take it out, you can see it. But I'm just saying, I gotta get paid somehow. I'm a stand up comic, I'm a poor guy. <laughs> all right, but I do, I have PTSD, and a lot of things trigger me. But now I wanna tell you about my temperament. Growing up now, I gotta tell you about my mom first. You don't understand why. Let me tell you about my mom. Growing up, I got a Bible-believing mother, Christian woman. You guys still that, right? And my mom always said, and she actually said this, give her temper to Jesus. Just when you get mad, pray to Jesus. Pray your temper away to Jesus. You never want to lose your cool. But every single time I get triggered or pissed off, the only thing I think about when I see someone stupid or acting stupid is how much I'm going to send that motherfucker to Jesus. That's the first thing. See, he feels me on that. Someone cut you up in traffic? Now, I tell you that because I was with my wife today. She works at a store like Walmart. It's a bit of Myers. You guys familiar with Myers? All right. So, I, I thought it'd be nice just being the holidays, you know, people driving crazy in the parking lots, right? And I'm trying not to get triggered here. My wife's like, just be nice. Be nice. Do what your therapist said. Be nice. And I'm trying. This guy, literally, there's two guys arguing. You got a picture of the scene. Picture the front of the store over here. This guy's arguing. He's in the car. He's arguing with someone outside the car. They get into a big argument. He kicks his car. He pulls off. I'm escorting. Now, I'm ex at this point, I am literally escorting my wife to the store, being gentlemanly, right? Because I don't want her ass to get ran over by all these crazy motherfuckers. I'm just being honest. So what does this guy do? He about runs over my wife. I had to push my wife out of the way. I literally had to push her, and he breaks, and his knee, and the bumper hits my knee. He got my blue jeans dirty. Can you believe that shit? <laughs> and my wife's in shirt. I'm just saying, these are good jeans. I paid thirty-eight dollars for these jeans. <laughs> and what did this guy do? I'm not making this up. This guy says, "What are you, retarded?" He hit me, and this dude had enough balls to call me retarded. <laughs> it's like, dude, I'm, I'm wondering, does this guy know I'm 6'5"? Can he not see the muscle tone? Can he, would you want to piss off someone at 6'5 that, that works out? Would you? Hell no! Let me tell you something. He didn't ask me, and I had a boss to ask me if I was retarded after he hit me. I said, probably, man. I screamed it at him. I said, yeah, I'm retarded. Because I, I must have been, I must be retarded. Because I'm the only one dumb enough to fuck your 